Welcome back. You send your kids off to school each day. You expect them to be safe and you expect them to learn. But a parent at Spokane's Lidgerwood Elementary School says that's not what's happening with her daughter. A little girl told her mom that she's being threatened daily by another fourth grader. Our Hawk Hammer working for you. He spoke with the mother this afternoon. And Hawk, this goes beyond bullying. Nadine, the mother I spoke with said the threats made against her daughter were graphic, violent, and so bad the only place her daughter feels safe right now is at home. She says the school has taken steps, but too little, too late. The school district says as soon as they found out about this, they did start putting a safety plan into place. They say they have at least eight staffers looking into it. This should be causing big, huge red flags for everybody involved, and it doesn't seem to be. Satira Dawson's daughter is a fourth grader at Lidgerwood Elementary in North Spokane. She says her daughter and a group of friends have been threatened by a fellow student in ways no fourth grader should have to worry about. Very graphic, very violent, and was really a huge cause for concern. To keep a record of what was said, one mother had her daughter write it all down to bring to the school's attention. One day it was a threat of rape and a threat of slitting one of the students necks open. Another was a threat of stalking, murdering families and decorating a room with one girl's blood. The threats go on in these notes. Dawson says the threats are making her daughter's life miserable at school and home as well. She doesn't want to go to school. She was up all night, not last night, the night before worrying and couldn't even fall asleep. She says she alerted Lidgerwood's principal last week, and three days later, the school took the student making the threats out of her daughter's class. She says it's not enough. I'm very angry that the school has done very minimal, and they're only being reactive, not proactive. But school district spokesman Kevin Morrison said they're taking this incident very seriously and have to account for the safety of all students. He says the district has a safety plan, and as soon as they heard the concerns, they started investigating. That investigation continues and will take some time because the district has to get permission from parents. Morrison says he understands the frustrations of a parent who thinks nothing is happening. However, he says because of privacy rules, they can't share all the details of the safety plan in place. And Morrison says he has faith in the principal here at Lidgerwood who has more than 30 years of educational experience and knows what safety steps and intervention steps that are needed. In Spokane tonight, I'm Hawk Hammer, KSLY 4 News. Thank you, Hawk.